Hey, what's up, all schools? It's Liam from Cancer Bats. Um, just here to talk about our new record, The Spark That Moves, and basically the top five albums that basically influenced uh, the record. Um, this is really tough because I feel like we listen to so much music and there's so many albums that we're kind of vibing on um, and like checking out. But I would say if I had to boil it down to five, um, definitely top of the list has to be Power Trip. Uh, for us, that album that they put out, Nightmare Logic. I feel like that kind of raised the bar as far as metal that was coming out at the time. Um, so that one had a huge influence on us, basically being like, we need to record a record that's as crazy as this. Like all these songs rip, all of the vibes are there. It's just like, okay, this is like the new level. Um, I would say same vibe uh, for our number two, uh, the new album from Sheer Mag, uh, Need to Feel Your Love. When that record came out, we were all just like so psyched. Like me, Mikey and Jay just listened to it nonstop. Um, I feel like it's such a rad combination of like fun punk rock with like really catchy vocals, really hooky guitar parts, but not too complicated. Like they just stick to the vibe. They just hammer it out and it's the best. Uh, so everyone needs to check that record out. Uh, another influence that I would say a huge one for us. Um, there's an amazing band from Canada that maybe some of you guys haven't heard of. They were called Lady Hawk. Uh, sadly they broke up, but they're definitely like one of our favorite bands. Um, specifically when we were writing the song, we were on free. We were looking, uh, to like Lady Hawk and in their songwriting, basically like how they made like song structures and they're not a metal band. They're more like a fun folk, like rock. They're still very punk, like in their approach, but, uh, they had this like amazing, like song structure that like we basically were just like, you know what, don't overthink things, like just make like a fun, like punk, like rock song and just like have a good time with it. So in that song, I referenced uh, Lady Hawk with the line, my old jackknife's always on me, uh, which is a Lady Hawk line from one of our favorite songs. So definitely check out Lady Hawk, that band is amazing. So third album that I would say was a huge influence, or fourth album I would say that was a huge influence on us. Um, Jay and I were jamming a ton of Aesop Ferg. Uh, we love listening to hip hop. And for us, like that record, we were super stoked because it's so hard, like it's such a tough record. But at the same time, it's also about so much like positivity. Like the album's called Always Strive and Prosper, which is like, it's like such a posy record for, what would be known as more like an otherwise like super hard dude who you know is known for trap music and is known for like pretty like gnarly tracks and I, I think the tracks are super gnarly at the same time having this like amazing like positive message um so for us we were like oh we're vibing on it because like it's super fun it's like a gnarly record but at the same time it's kind of like what we do with cancer bats in that like our you know our record is like really loud and really noisy and crazy but it's also got you know this positive message and it's all about like having a good time so we definitely were like really psyched on those aspects of like Aesop Ferg and trying to figure out like how we could implement some of those like more so in the same vibe. Uh, and the last record that I would say has a huge influence on us. I mean, we're massive Entombed fans. I think everyone can hear it in our records. And for us, like Wolverine Blues is always the album that we go back to. Uh, and we make sure that we're, you know, having a record that holds up to those standards and is just as banging and just as awesome as something like that. So there you have it. That's our five most influential records, uh, I would say, to uh, the new Cancer Bats record, The Spark That Moves. Please check out our album, and thanks for having us on the site. Cheers. Yeah.